Hey guys, Joshua Gadamu here with our Iron Man toy review, and today's review is brought to you by TrainsAndToysoldiers.com. There's a link for them down below in the more info area, so make sure to check them out. They have all kinds of different toy soldiers. They have trains too. Who do? Anyways, today we are reviewing Robin Hood's Men, Outlaws of Sherwood Forest. Continuing tradition of Barzo's Playsets. My only guess is that Barzo's Playsets is a company that perhaps was bought out by Laud Enterprises. But not entirely sure. This is figure set number six. And if you want detailed guys that have no flashing on them pretty much whatsoever, boy, these are, are just amazing. They're perfect. They're perfect figures. They are full of detail. There's 16 total, and they're all of Robin Hood's men. Yeah, here we got little John with his big stick. Talk in a little voice and carry a big stick. <laughs> uh, there's numerous, numerous archers. This looks like something straight out of, like, wargaming for, you know. I can see here Robin Hood now. Men, we're going on a quest. We're going to take the war to the elves. <laughs> and we're going to win. That's debatable. There's all kinds of detail. Every guy is unique. Like this guy here is probably my favorite. Got this huge battle axe. He's got a dagger. I mean, this guy is all about close range. So cool. You look at the face, too. Tons of detail in there. Just tons of detail. To imagine that this is Robin Hood with a little kind of goatee going on. Maybe I'm crouching, trying to hunt. And then maybe him again, sword fighting. And then running. We, yeah, yeah, that could be him too. You know, it's hard to say who's Robin Hood and who are his merry men. You know? But they're very cool, and there are different sculpts, though. Like this guy here, he's got a beard. Totally different guy than our, our Robin Hood. So, very, very neat. Just to make sure that we cover all eight sculpts really, really quick. Little John with his big stick. Crouching with the bow and arrow, standing with the bow and arrow. Aiming the bow and arrow. You don't really get to see him very much. Okay. The axe guy. So he married an axe murderer. Sword fight. So yeah, awesome set. Yeah, my only wish is though that it was a bigger set. Like, I wouldn't mind having a set of eight um, Robin Hood's men and then like eight Sherwood Forest guys or Petty Thieves or, you know, just random bad guys for these guys to fight. They would be fun, too. Like, we could go through the forest and we could fight monsters or, you know. There's, there's just quite a lot of fun. They're a little taller than your standard two-inch soldiers. Take a Timmy Army Man. Put him up for comparison. You can see there. Kind of different in our height. Crouching guy, we're pretty fit pretty well. So larger, larger scale figures than your standard two inch, but beautifully sculpted, wonderfully made, perfect, truly perfect. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the review. Make sure to like, favor, and subscribe as I post a new army toy review every Friday. And please check out our sponsor. There's a link for them down below in the more info area, and they sell all kinds of different toy soldiers, uh, not just uh, the historical ones. See you guys next time.